Hey everybody, hope you're having an awesome week. It's your boy Clark here, and I'm back at you with another video. As some of you might know, I love taking recommendations from my viewers. And so in this video, thanks to one of those recommendations, I'm going to get to try Venezuelan arepas for the very first time. Get excited everyone, because it's time to get food. We're here in North York near Kiel and Lawrence to throw down at the Arepa Republic. The couple that started this hidden gem came to Canada a little over 10 years ago and dreamed of sharing the flavors of their native land with all the people. And today, the Arepa Republic and their team of amazing and super friendly staff are slinging delicious and healthy Venezuelan dishes from both food trucks and this permanent location that I'm checking out today. So here we are at Arepa Republic and I'm so excited and I'm so hungry and I can't wait to eat. I'm going to be getting a couple of arepas to show you guys as well as some chicken empanadas and also something called tequeños. Here comes the food. Look at that. This one is a papelon and goes with the tequeños. Fantastic. The green one for the yuca fries. Right. Garlic mayo for the empanadas and the arepas. Great, Enjoy. thank you so much. There's so much amazing food here, I don't even know where to start, but why don't we start with the tequeños? So tequeños is this traditional fried cheese stick. And you can see out here this nice breading, and I can feel it inside is this soft gooey cheese. So take a look in here. You've got the breading on the outside and this nice pillowy cheese here. And you can see this little pocket of air that they've got it in. It's not oily or greasy or anything like that. Mmm. This is one of the really popular items and I can definitely see why. This makes for such a great snack or a start to your meal. Mmm. If you're not a fan of really strong or really pungent cheeses, then this one might be right up your alley. It has a little bit of saltiness, but it's got that great familiar cheese taste as well. Mm. Next up, we have the empanada. Ooh, it's nice and hot. I'm gonna break this open so I can show you guys. See those juices coming out of it? <laughs> So here's our chicken empanada, but they do a cheese and a beef one as well. So you do have a couple of choices with that. So you can see in there, it's got that nice, I think it's like a stewed chicken. And it, you can see like those little orange bits. So it looks like there's either pepper or maybe even some carrot. Not sure. Take a bite and find out. Oh. That chicken is so moist. And the empanada on the outside. It's so light and crispy. Mm. So they fry up these empanadas nice and crisp on the outside, but moist, juicy, packed with so much flavor on the inside. Mm. Mm -hmm. So as I mentioned, I got two awesome arepas to show you guys. So if you're not as familiar with arepa, it's a very common and staple dish in South America. So you can see in there all that delicious shredded flank steak, all that beef. And they pack this arepa with this white cheese here, and you've got beans here, as well as a couple of sweet plantains. So you can see right on first bite, I got a little bit of everything, except maybe the beans. But I got a mouthful of that beef and that cheese. Mm. Cheese is nice, light, gives it a little bit of saltiness. And the sweet plantain comes in with a bit of that sweetness. Mm. The beans, mm, let, me get a, let me get a bite with the beans. Mm. 
Mm. The beans give it that hardiness. But you all know which is a star, right? The meat is just so juicy and bursting with flavor. Mm. It's got that natural taste of the beef, but the herbs and the spices really come through as well. Mm. It's that whole combination with the sweet, the saltiness, and the richness of that meat. Mm. So this pavillon con limon, they use real sugar cane in order to sweeten it. Mm. It's got that nice tart lemon taste. Oh, absolutely perfect and refreshing on a hot day. The next one I have here is a rombera, and this one is pork. Again, it's this nice shredded pulled pork, but here they've got the two different kinds of cheeses. So you get such great value here. I mean, look at this thing. It's bigger than my fist. <laughs> Let's give this one a taste. Mmm. Mmm. If it's one thing I've noticed, with all the meats here and all the proteins, it's just how moist and juicy and how it brings out the natural flavor of the meat. Mmm. 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 This one's got great pork flavor. Mmm. The cheese is just there to add a little bit of creaminess and richness to it. Oh man. It's so juicy and so moist. I'm making a total mess of myself. Mmm. Mmm. Let's get another sip of this lemonade. Mmm. Oh, nice. So from a dietary standpoint, the Arepa Republic is fantastic. The Arepas are made with corn flour. So if you're looking for gluten-free options, this is your ticket. They also have vegetarian options as well and can adjust the menu to make it fully vegan if that's what you're looking for too. Wow, that was amazing. Thank you again to the folks at Arepa Republic. It was so awesome to be able to hang out with you guys this morning and taste all of this amazing food. If you guys enjoyed this video, then you know what I'm gonna say, right? Of course. Please help us out, give it the thumbs up, leave a comment below and let me know what you guys think. Remember to subscribe and hit the bell icon if you haven't already so that I can catch you all very soon the next time I get food. <laughs>